So how's it hanging, folks? And welcome back to the Game Boy Movie Fanatic 0129 channel. I am your host, Jared Graham, and today we will be talking about the Zack Snyder Justice League final trailer. Of course. Because if they going to... Because if Marvel going to drop a final trailer, you know DC going to drop a final trailer. <sighs> it's, it's, it's unnecessary one-upmanship, if you ask me. But we are going to discuss Zack Snyder Justice League, the final trailer. Of course, there's some people who already got to see it early, which sucks for me because I got to wait to Thursday to see it. I mean, the, um, overall, it's been positive for the movie. Like, I, I was kind of expecting some people to not like it, but there's a lot of people who really like this movie. And Thursday cannot get here fast enough, but you know, let's, let's, just, let's talk about this trailer, shall we? Of course. It begins with, so begins the end. Of course, Ste Steppenwolf says that. And there, yeah, Steppenwolf says that while a shot of Dark Side is playing. And behind him is the three mother bird, mother, I say mother bird. No, the three mother boxes are behind him. And he's doing, he's performing the unity. And then we, of course, cut to Batman on the back tank where he's talking about how he spent so much time trying to divide, to divide the members of the Justice League. And how he made a promise to Superman that he will unite them. And well, no better time to unite them than against Dark Side, where one woman talks about how she never seen a being this powerful aside from Superman. Of course, Superman is resurrected. If you've seen the original Justly, you know things do not go well. Superman returns and he beats the holy crap uh everybody in Justice League. So yeah. <laughs> it was it was pretty bad. So, as so, as the way as with the first trailer, there is a lot. I mean, there's a lot. Jack and I packs a whole lot within two minutes and thirty seconds. Like there's so much. I mean, there's Lois Lane, Lane uh, going to Superman's monument that was destroyed in B BBS Batman vs Superman. And one woman seeing the drawing, K drawing of Dark Side. Of course, we see the history lesson where Dark Side is basically destroying a planet. And then we see the Atlanteans, the Amazonians, um, humans, and the guys teaming up to stop Dark Side from destroying Earth. Of course, well, there's no lanterns, no Kryptonians, so now. It, now Earth is white for the picking for Dark Side, and Stephen Wolf is basically the harbinger of doom. And he retrieves the mother box. There is a side of him having all three of the mother boxes, and it's about to trigger the unity. Which, from what which, from what I can tell, I think the Justice League might fail. I'm just this saying they might fail. It's a possibility. There, of course, the Flash moving warp speed. You see Cyborg. You see off man, you know, in the cool slow mo shot where he's getting up and guffed by waves. There's the scene where he dodges stepping whoops um stepping whoops wolf's at Lord, I can't talk. There's a scene where he dodges stepping whoops big weapon, his axe. He dodges that. As in seen in the in the two thousand seventeen trailer for the original Justice League. Of course, we see back, we see Superman in his black suit, his iconic black suit, and I think I'm trying to fail to mention the scene where Batman is on top of the Bat tank. Now he has a number of weapons, a number of things that pop up: the Bat tank, Batmobile, the Bat weapon. Why did it say Bat weapon? The Bat crawler, and there's a lot of explosions, a lot of parademons getting picked off. By the heroes, and then there's the scene where one woman and Offman are battling Seven Wolf, and of course there's a quick scene of Joker. I think there's a lot more Joker, and also another scene that I would like to talk about. It looked like Martha Manhunter is basically impersonating Martha Kent, Superman's mom. But why? What? What's, what's the point? I mean, out of context, it's strange. I'm certain in the movie, in the, in context of a certain scene, it would make sense. And then, of course, you have Cyborg's dad, Silas Stone. 
with spoiler alert, he kind of gets blown up. Miles Dyson style. I mean, you see Terminator 2, Judgment Day, you know that reference. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> and it's, all, it's all bad for post cyborg. But hope, but hopefully they prevail in the end. No. Well, it is a four-hour movie, so <laughs> they definitely prevailing in. And well, that definitely the trailer, the final trailer for Zack Snyder Just League, summed up in a nutshell. You know, I did. I know I didn't cover a whole lot of the trailer, but I just, just you know, I think it's better for y'all to experience the, the, you know. The full glory of this trailer than me telling you all all the bits and pieces in it. So yeah, that's the that's not just sleep I trailer in a nutshell. And that is the conclusion of this video. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're new right here, have a nice rest of your day. And oh yeah, comment down below. Are you hyped for Jack Not Just Lee or are you against that Not Just Are you I didn't let me rephrase that. Are are you um are you not interested in Jack Snyder Justice League? I know there's some people who think it's gonna be the same movie, but there are more there are a number of people who are very hyped for this movie. Me included. So yeah, definitely Thursday I will be watching. And knowing me, I'm gonna probably watch all four hours of the movie. I mean <laughs> I I've been waiting for this movie for a long time, so definitely gonna watch all four hours. And I, I know I did. I know I just basically conclude the video, but I'm still talking. So comment down below, and have a nice rest of your day.